Tonight, hundreds of people in Santa Barbara remember the 34 people killed in that deadly dive boat fire earlier this week. Authorities have now identified 23 of those victims, including seven people from Southern California. NBC4's Jonathan Gonzalez was at the vigil tonight as the community struggles to find strength in this tragedy. Jonathan. And Colleen, we learned today from authorities that of the 34 victims, one of the bodies is yet to be recovered and that the cause of death was smoke inhalation. Meanwhile, people continue to come at this hour to come and leave flowers and pay tribute to those who died. And earlier, Santa Barbara came out to remember them. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound. In a town too familiar with tragedy. Tonight, Tonight once, once again, again we, we gathered gather to pull together. One thing the people of Santa Barbara have learned is how to heal. To listen and understand. To grieve and to comfort. The hundreds who came to Chase Palm Park tonight know that to heal, they must be able to feel the pain and the loss. Though it can be very hard, be encouraged that what you may feel also is connected to what you love. That love was shown tonight for the 34 people who died off the coast of Santa Cruz Island Monday morning when their boat caught fire. Each soul represented by diving tanks to remember how they were spending their time on the water. When you see a dolphin, remember, remember our brothers and sisters. With each white flower, Santa Barbara paid their respects to those who are lost and to their families who live on without them. Share in the, the love that surrounds everybody and just try to move forward. If the sky that we look upon. And tonight, Santa Barbara learned to heal. Should tumble and fall. All together. And the mountains. Once again. Should crumble to the sea. And authorities will have to wait a few days, they say, until the winds die down so that they can pull the wreckage of the conception out of the water. Meanwhile, still no word on what caused the fire. Reporting in Santa Barbara, I'm Jonathan Gonzalez, NBC4 News.